So in this video, we're going to go through this article to make sure that this component works. So here we're looking at the hero text component in the Java logic that has come from the article. So what we're going to do is compile this. Um, so <clears throat> I've compiled this using the Java um, p auto install package command. And we can see that it successfully has built. So now we're ready to go into Experience Manager and then um, code this component on the front end. So before we um, code the component, let's take a look at the back end, make sure that the OSGI bundle is running. So we go to Operations, Web Console, OSGI bundles. Here we can see the project my HTL 6.3 and it's an active state. So this is exactly what should be happening at this point. So here's the front end. Notice under my HTL 6.3 under the hello world, we've updated this component. So we put in our front end HTL logic. Notice that the hero text object in this case is referencing this hero text component which maps to the back end to the java so we're using the fully qualified object name so it's com community am core hero text component of course that's lining up with this so as we just saw it's running within the osgi bundle that's an active state so we have our dialogue here and it's um it's going to be letting us set the uh, heading text and description. So we're ready to test this. So let's go to our uh, sites. We'll go to the English page out of this project, open it up. And then we'll simply open up the dialog, we'll say uh, hello new year 2019 and then just say click the check and then you can see that this is updated with the new values. So this is exactly what should be happening if you set up your project, your code, uh, make sure your bundle is in active state, you'll get these results. And if um, you're having problems with the project, you can always go to the article and then download this package and install it and then you'll um, get the same results. Thank you.